This is a Texas coral snake, and it's two, and a, two feet and five inches long. And I tried to feed it a couple of weeks ago, but it was really full, and it wasn't interested in eating. I'm going to try it one more time. It's a very pretty snake, as far as the colors. It's, it's usually very gentle. Oh, it's shedding. Look at that. Isn't that interesting? They get so much brighter, the colors, and so much shinier when they shed their skin. See here, it has some of the skin that it shed. See, it's a very pretty snake. See, smelling my hand. I'll put it down. I have two little, really young mice. Well, that probably got it in a bad mood. And maybe it's hungry this week. It doesn't seem interested in the small mice. Their favorite foods are small frogs and other small snakes. So, I'll try to find some. We'll try this next time. It may eat them during the night if it's hungry. It's been very impressive how how high this snake can stand up without a support. In the last few days it's got up to within five inches of just its tail with nothing to lean on on the top.
There's the un that was there's the underside of the belly, the stomach. In the past, I never realized that they were this very good, that good at climbing. Time for me to get back to work. I'm going to leave the mice in there overnight. And maybe it will eat, eat one of them if it's hungry. They will not eat if they're not hungry. And one other thing, every snake has to have water to drink. And this one, a few weeks ago when it was very warm here in Texas, it would be curled up in this bowl of water. They are very shiny, especially when they, they're shedding their old skin, like this one. See the difference in the front half and the back half? It's through shedding now, and it's the time of year when the snakes are going to den up for the cold weather that's coming eventually. So it's time to let it go. It's the first time I've been able to witness a coral snake shedding its skin. This is really interesting. You notice I moved the piece of the log that it's been staying under and crawling on and it used to help the, shed, the shedding skin to peel off. I didn't know where it was. And under this coffee can lid, look right there. There he is. All right, and it's all—it's real nice and shiny now, and ready to den up for the winter. Apparently, I'm gonna let it go so it can get a good a good meal in its stomach, and go to go to sleep for the winter. <laughs>